you know, the cough, the uh, fevers. I had did about 10 days of that. Ron Sikama says those symptoms in the midst of a battle with lymphoma prompted his wife to take him to UC Westchester Hospital on March 28th. The Loveland man says his oxygen levels were plummeting. Doctors found he had COVID-19. My lungs just basically almost failed and then I went into the... Uh, uh, ventilator for, for a period of time. He remembers a fraction of his 38 days in the hospital, moments like his 55th birthday in his room. His friends, family, and Procter & Gamble co-workers celebrated from outside. I said to my wife, it was the best birthday I've had in 55 years because uh, even though it was an isolation, I never felt more loved. Ron says he was given COVID-19 convalescent plasma on May 1st in an attempt to boost his immune system. I think it is part of getting on the road to recover quicker. I, they will learn. I think they'll figure it out whether what's the right time to do it. He was discharged May 4th. Doctors with the Hawksworth Blood Center say dozens of CCP units have been distributed in three weeks. And anecdotally, I think there's a lot of optimism that this is actually making a difference uh, for the patients who are receiving it. While Ron isn't sure what CCP can do, he got to go home and hopes people keep donating. I feel very, very good. Uh, and I would tell you that you know, I, I consider that part of the journey. Um, and uh, I'm glad I, I'm glad I did it. All right, so Ron says that three of his four sons and his wife had the virus. He says his other son is actually separated right now, and they are all in quarantine. As far as his cancer treatments, his doctors say they're not too concerned right now. They believe he can wait a while before he gets back to all of those and that he should be in good shape. Reporting live at the Hawksworth Blood Center, Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5.